Hello game devs. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create an animated GIF with GDevelop. So first of all, what I want you to do is you want to get to that of your about GDevelop. And you have, if you have not updated that of your GDevelop software, you want to update it by clicking on check again for new update. So that is going to check for updates and going to update your software. Right now, I currently do not have internet connection, so I cannot do that. Okay, so let's get into this video. So first of all, in order for you to be able to create that of your animated GIF, you want to add animation. So click on create a new project. This is for those who are new. So you want to get to that of empty game. And right here, you want to click on this plus symbol. Double click on new scene and you should have this open up. So from here, you want to click on the plus symbol and we are going to add a few animations. So get to sprite. Click on add an animation and you want to click on add. So you want to locate your animation and these are my sprites. So I'm going to pick three of them. This looks like a kicking sprite. So I'll go for that of kicking three, four and five. And then click on open. So right here, I just added my animation. So I'm going to check the loop. And I can increase and decrease the frame per second according to the timer right here. But I like it at 0 0.08, so that should be okay for me. So with this, you want to get into Edit with Pscale. So click on Edit with Pscale. This is going to open GDevelop's very own drawing tool. So from here, you want to get to right here, Export. Click on that image. And you want to click on Download as an animated GIF. So if you want to make changes, you can go ahead and make changes, but I will not be making changes to this. I think it's okay. It's centered and I like the way it actually is. So I'm going to click on download and you want to save it without changing the name. If you change the name, it's going to affect it and it's probably not going to be saved as a gift. So you want to leave the name as it is before you imported the sprites or animation and click on that of save. So now you're going to have it located at the book very place you actually saved let me close this so this is the gif i'm going to double click to open it and voila you have your animated gif so this is a character kicking you can tell it's kicking it's kicking it's, it keeps kicking <laughs> so this is quite interesting so this right here is your animated gif and it was done with g develop if this video was helpful don't forget to click on the like button subscribe if you haven't subscribed here right here on this channel we learn how to create games using game engines and i do tutorials a lot of tutorials i have so many of them so you want to get into the playlist and check them out i'm sure you will find whatever you're looking for if you do not find it don't forget to leave a comment and i'm probably going to make a tutorial on that for you thank you very much for watching this video and i'm going to see you in my next video keep creating game devs uh -huh.